Is she going out for a smoke? Smoking will kill you, lady. Well, I'll kill you while you're smoking. That is a shocking accident, wouldn't you say, Diana? Did you see, Diana? That was me. I know it looked like an accident, but it was me. Are you proud? Are you pleased? Is this what you wanted? Does it please you? Diana, please. All right, tour time. Let's go. Um, yeah, I have a question. I'm not really a wine guy. I'm more of a beer beer drinker. Um, how, is, how is beer made? Is it similar? Right, here we are in Argentina. And as far as I can tell, I've only got one objective, which is to walk up to Diana. So... Mission complete, I guess. Hi everyone, welcome back to Three Ways to Play with Outside Xbox. We're back in Hitman 3, and we're on the uh, the Mendoza mission, which is a uh, lovely Argentinian wine country. There's a vineyard down there, got some mountains. First things first, in this mission, we have to talk to Diana. Here she is, outlined in blue, and we've got to find out what her allegiance is, as if we don't know. Well, 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 47. Look at you. you sure are wearing that tuxedo. You got my message. You'd never get caught on camera. Not unless you wanted to be seen. So what's the play? You're not the only one who's been busy, 47. I'm this close to becoming the next constant. I'll be able to dismantle Providence from the inside. Only one man stands in my way. Don Yates. That weasel was the partner's legal counsel for years. He's the top candidate. But remove him from the playing field. It won't work. If Edward suspects... I will convince him you acted alone. Retaliation for Grey. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. The Herald, Tamara Vidal. She has eyes everywhere, and they're all fixed on you. The plan won't work unless we take her out. She never leaves my sight for long. Whatever your plan is, I'll help you if I can. You're sure about this? As sure as I'll ever be. <gasps> She touched your hand, 47. Human contact. So meaningful, even with the evening gloves on. Well, there you go. Diana is on our side, she says. And I see no reason to doubt Diana, right? She's nice. Just because she is risen to the top of Providence. She's doing it all um, to bring them down from inside, I believe it. You cut the tension with a knife, but I've got to go and cut some people with a knife instead. All right. Off to a party. Where are my targets? There they are, miles away. Miles away. All right. We can do this. We can manage this. I hope it's not one of those parties where you get frisked on the way in. There's the house. Here's the driveway and the vineyard. Here's a news crew. And we know what we do with news crews in Hitman. Hang on one sec. <laughs> just just got to take a second to look right down the lens, get my face on camera. Got to do it. Got to do it for old time's sake. Two. Oh, <laughs> Such a great callback to Paris. The whole world is my playground. Oh, man. Look how much this guy looks like. 47. Or like a rubbish sort of egg version of 47. Hmm. Dangerous cliff path, is it? Okay, this looks... Um, this looks promising. Ah, okay. Time for a disguise already, is it, 47? Yes, why not? Why not? Treat yourself. Okay, I am now a gaucho. Ah, oh, yes. Look at that belt. I look like a wrestling champion. And the, uh... Ah, oh, the, the plus fours and the sporty cravat. Loving the whole look, 47. Okay, and this is... So that's the way into the party proper. And over here is, I guess, the the grounds. Okay, this is the grounds of the the main house. And um, these fellas with guns tell me uh, I'm not welcome. Is that right? Let's find out. Just, just gonna, just gonna... Yeah, that's a no. That's a big no and a big shotgun. So I'm gonna go a different way instead of blowing my cover straight out the gate. Let's just hand over this invite. Gracias, señor. Enjoy the party. I love a level that starts with a legit invitation. Look at this, would you? Check the heck out of this party. They've got a dessert buffet. Yes, please. Man, enjoying this wine, 47. When in a vineyard, you've got to drink the vino. And everyone's tangoing. This is what I call the solo tango. The 47 tango. 
Yeah, see, I can dance too. Look, this one. Call this the, the crouching tango. And uh, you want to dance? Anyone? Miss? Madam? Excuse me, sir. Would you like to dance? Is that a no? No one. No one's up for Dancing with 47. I'm liking the pink suit. Look at this outfit. Is this like traditional Argentinian guard wear? It's incredible. Uh, let's go to the actual party, though. Mingle a bit. Would you care for an aperitif? No, I'm okay, thank you. I don't drink except when the mission is done, when I get absolutely plastered. Hello, fellow gauchos. Good to see you. What's up, yo? Yeah, good. I'm good. Okay, so this is the winery, I think. Um, target is... Oh, hang on, we've got a vent. All right. I think I can hack that with my camera. Let's have a look. Yes, all right. Where's this going to take us? The production room. Okay, that's cool. And I'm not trespassing. I'm allowed to be in here as a gaucho. All right, well, let's just have a little look around, see what we've got. What's this? Cabernet Sauvignon for later, maybe. Nice celebratory glass. Screwdriver. Thank you. What's this? Key. Winery workers key. All right, that's going to come in handy as well. This is good. They've laid out a load of stuff for me. Thanks, winery. Okay, not that way. So this is a fermentation room. Uh, oh, hello. Okay, this is some kind of giant wine press. Um, and I think I can just... Oh, it's that key I picked up. Brill. Okay, I've <laughs> I've taken off the safety device from this wine press. All right, I think I know what I want to do <laughs> for my first kill. How do I get her to stand in the wine press? Okay, that's my next that's my next challenge. Trying to figure out how to get her to stand in a wine press. I'm sure we can figure it out. Forty seven. After all, you're the heavyweight champion of Argentina. Well, here is target number one in the blue dress. That's Tamara, and she is tailing my good friend Diana. So they're, they're circulating the party together. Okay. Oh, hang on. I'm starting to form an idea. And it is electrocution, always. I'm, I'm getting a taste for it. That's my MO, my signature kill right now. So if I want to electrocute anyone, I'm going to need a screwdriver, which I did not bring. Um, I've never, never actually seen this level before. Okay, there's another. Yeah, here we go. And there's a hose pipe and a sabotageable like garden lamp thing so man though that view huh that is gorgeous all right hitman showing off look at this another electrical thing another another sabotageable electrical thing and another hose pipe right this level is basically begging me to electrocute someone okay we just need to figure out how to um how to get the target to go and stand in a big wine press which um might prove tricky but, you know, maybe I can persuade her. Let's uh, let's head inside and see what's going on in the actual public part of this of this winery. Okay, well there's there's the target. With Diana. Duty calls. Let me guess, the Burnwood woman. That's right. Gates has arranged for the chief winemaker to take Burnwood and Tamara Vidal on a grand tour of the estate. Oh, okay, okay. The chief winemaker is going to take Diana and the target on a tour of the winemaking facilities, which surely, surely, surely involves inspecting the wine press. It must do. Okay, and this guy is going to be on the tour as well, this Corvo Black. So if I just were to become Corvo Black, I would get to go on the tour as well, right? Let's follow Corvo Black. Let's go to the reception. I'm liking this sort of coppery stuff going on. Lovely. Oh, this is one of the targets. <laughs> the option to subdue is tempting, but um, probably a bad idea. She's going to stand there. There's like one noticer over there. Who's that? And how do they know me? Those trousers. Though. Look at those trousers. It's like an optical illusion. Where do his legs actually go? Bizarre. Oh, this guy's going to turn around and I'm going to be in real trouble. Fine. 
Right. How am I supposed to kill this lady in a giant explosion when Diana's standing right there and I'm not allowed to eliminate Diana Burnwood? This will be my greatest challenge yet. So we're off to find a screwdriver. Now, if I were a screwdriver, I would not be in the Fancy Pants party. I would be somewhere in the kind of mechanical part of the winery. You know what I mean? Like in a tool shed or um, some kind of workshop. There's the vineyard, though. Can I uh, take a little tour? Take a little... It's just grapes, man. And am I allowed in here? Man with gun. Yeah, that's a no. That's also a no. Not also not allowed in there. Not a problem. Not a problem. I'll tell you why. I'm going to get this vineyard labourer. Going to come and check me out in this... What's this? This lavender hedge. Yeah. Perfect cover to sneak up. You choke him out. There we go. Quietly, my friend. He's going to wake up so fragrant in this in this lavender hedge. I get my coin back. And uh, quickly change out of this tux. Which is a shame because it's one hell of a tux. But now, I believe... Oh, I've got a cheeky few top buttons undone there, 47. I believe I'm allowed in here now. Hey, your partner. Yep, that's a yep. That's a yes, okay. Affirmative. All right, gained entrance. Okay, the way to get further in, into this winemaking... Oh, 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 now. Now that looks like a bad time. Do we really need that for mincing up the grapes? Seems extreme. Seems extremely dangerous. Okay, there's a noticer down there. So if I just vault, quick vault and a shimmy and a drop and yeah, there we go. We're past him. Okay, I think this Corvo Black is um, is being tasked with killing Diana. So probably this is a, a good idea on several levels for us to take him out. All right, Corvo, if you would just like to secrete yourself somewhere. Somewhere quiet, somewhere isolated. I mean, yeah, here is here is actually pretty good. Here looks pretty good. All right, let's just uh, just real quick subdue Mr. Black here, and then I'm Corvo Black. Time to go on the tour. Now remember, we're looking for a screwdriver. Okay, I'm going to need to get past this noticer. Okay, I'm just going to coin. Coin the noticer neatly to the far side of the room and then I can sneak in and see what's what. What do we got? Okay, I'll take it. And I'll take... Yeah, why not? I'll have one of those. And... Ooh. Hang about. Yes! 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 Okay. We have acquired screwdriver. That's exactly what I need to carry out my signature kill. Ah, screwy. You and me. There's a lot of chat going on. A lot of story. And I don't care for it. I don't mind telling you. Okay, right. So they're sitting down at the moment. That chandelier is, is tantalisingly close, but not close enough, sadly. What have we got in, in terms of deadly weaponry? I've not really seen a lot of deadly weaponry around here. This is a bush I could hide in. I mean, I could. Where is she? Oh, they're over there, aren't they? They're behind a load of meat. A literal meat shield. I think even for my fantastic uh, marksmanship skills with a pistol. She's a little far away at the moment. Although they are moving closer. I could dress as a waiter, but at the moment I'm not feeling not feeling a strong urge to to get out of my tuxedo at the moment. Where are they heading? Oh, they're going down downstairs? I, that lady just walked directly into me. And is now suspicious. So many bottles of wine, and yet none of them are available to be grabbed and wanged at someone's head. And yet, oh Malbec. I mean, <laughs> forty-seven. That that is not how anyone carries a bottle of wine if they're planning on drinking it. All right, that's Corvo Black hidden. So let's, uh, yeah, let's uh, let's get going. Let's get on this tour. Nice. Um, Nice duds, by the way, 47. Really digging the trainers and the beret. Oh, there's Diana and the target. Hey, hi, Diana, it's me, 47. Diana. Diana, it's me, Agent 47. Agent 47, Hitman. Presumably they're heading to where the tour is going to happen, I think. I don't know. Let's have a look. 
All right. Well, maybe I need to like check in or something. Um, hey, how you doing? Hey, good. Thank you. Let's. I'm sure we can figure this out. Hi, yeah. I'm supposed to go on a winery tour. And welcome to the Yates Winery. How may I help? You? Corval Black. Yes. Yes. Good. I am on the tour. Mr. Black. Welcome. Miss Burnwood and Miss Vidal will meet you down by the wine fields. Yep. I trust you know the way. I can mm -hmm. find my way around. Enjoy. That. Easy. Will do. Good. Now we can finally get this tour going. Cool, okay, ready to take the tour. Guys, I hear there is an amazing wine press in there. You can stand right in it. You must be Yates's garbage man. Sorry, but I didn't catch your name. This is Corvo Black. Black tomorrow. He's the ICA regular. I only nice, Diana. Nice. We're all here, it seems. Nice, she's buying it, even guy, though... Diana is, Diana is me. Looks like we're stuck here until someone fetches him. Diana is me, 47. Black. I'm looking in your direction. Hold on. What? I'll track him down. Oh. At a boy. Right. Try and bring him back in one piece. Chief winemaker. Okay. Probably in the wine field, right? Do any of you look like a chief winemaker? Guy in the hat, right? That's a chief winemaker hat if I ever saw one. Yes. Get on the tour. Oh, my God. What? So do I have to manually ripen the grapes somehow? This is the hardest wine tour to get on in history. Okay. I am, of course, going to change back into my tuxedo. Because I'm heading back to the party. Also, I'm not leaving this tuxedo here. It cost a fortune. Right. There, there's my target and my very important non-target Diana, who I must not kill. Do not kill. I think I've just missed them going on a walk past. Yes, thank you. Appreciate it. Must have just missed them going on a walk past this electrocution opportunity. So, so that's a shame. What I will do, I'll tell you what, is I'm going to clear the area so when they come back around, I won't accidentally electrocute any innocent victims. So if I can just get this bodyguard over here. I'm just going to clear the area, just create some space. Because I learned my lesson from last time. I don't want a cascading failure of multiple non-target kills. So the only solution is to choke everyone out and leave them in this lavender hedge. Shh, sleep, sleep. What a lovely place to wake up, this fragrant hedgerow. The area is nice and clear. This walkway is the perfect kill site if I can just get Tamara over here. Okay, what I need to do is sabotage this. And why not? Let's pre-prepare this part. It's not deadly until I flood the area with um, the host pipe. Oh, are they coming? Are they coming this way? Yes. Oh, this guy's off to get a picking knife, which sounds useful. Let's follow him. Oh. oh come on. I left it right. Okay. So now I can be a winery worker. <sighs> okay, so I need to um I guess I need to pick some grapes to take them to the wine guy. So what are the okay, these are these are sprinklers. Okay, oh, here we go. Grape knife. That'll probably come in handy. So, some of these. Aha, aha, aha. Here's another. I'm just going to grab a whole bunch of grapes and then just just show up with them and see if that see if that works. Hi, yes, I've picked you your grapes. I have the three grapes you requested. Yes, good. Great. Here you go. Good size. Yeah, good. Good grapes. Good for winemaking. Ready to do that tour now? Finally, I say these grapes are ripe for harvest. If Great. The workers. Will you, Ramon? I... Yes, tour to conduct. All right. Right. Okay. Well, I've got a bottle of wine. I'm not convinced it'll be lethal. I should go out for a smoke. Smoking will kill you, lady. Well, I'll kill you while you're smoking. Hello. Uh, you, the lady. And now you're saying hello. Weird. Weird lady. I think. I think she might have the hots for me. Oh, I'm being spotted. I'm being spotted. I don't like it. It's that guy. It's that one guy. It's that one noticer in the entire level. And oh, he keeps noticing. Stop! Oh god, I'm like crouching next to the table where my uh, potential victim is. Why don't we go in? Can we go and deal with this Corvo black guy first? Because he, 
he is a real pain. He's getting in the way of my of my stuff. So and look, he's isolating himself. So if I just if I just absolutely send the Malbec, or just just push him off. Big big mistake. Mate. What a terrible accident! What a terrible accident! The one noticer in the entire level has suffered. <laughs> that was. I know it's a non-target kill, but I, I think I'm entirely fair in doing that. Okay, now I've got to be very careful not to murder Diana by accident because that would be a deep, deep tragedy. Something that 47 could never come back from. Um, but they appear to have stopped by the railing, which is, which is inconvenient, I must say. Oh no, they're going back. Okay, I'm gonna have to figure out a way to get them over here or it's all for nothing. And now they're going down here. What's down here? Hopefully electrocution opportunities because I've committed now. It's electrocution or nothing. Electrocution or I go home. What is it, some sort of wine bar? Well, very nice, good for you. Good for you, Diana. I'm sure you're having a lovely time while I do all the legwork. I assume there are like a million opportunities for me to poison someone in this level. There's a lot of wine being drunk. Oh look, tomorrow's peeling off. Where's she going? Somewhere to be uh, electrocuted? Or buy some faulty wiring maybe? Maybe a fuse box? A big puddle? Diana's coming back, but that's okay. There's a bit of separation now. Oh no, she just wandered away for a moment. They're joined at the hip practically, which is gonna be dicey. Really do not want to electrocute Diana. Well, not only do I not want to do it, I, I will actually fail the level if I do, so. Now to become Corvo Black again real quick. And finally, time for the tour. Yes? I hope so. Hope I don't have to make 600 bottles of wine before he'll let me go on a tour. All right, tour time. Let's go. Follow me. These are busy times. All right. My question is this. Do we get free wine? Second question. How much free wine do we get? Third question. Can I have some free wine? Mmm. Yes, and you fill this trough with wine, do you? And you're telling me wine comes from grapes? Last but not least, to our trusty grape crusher. Interesting. Wouldn't you say, Mr. I would say that, yeah, the grape crusher is very interesting. Um, yeah, I have a question. I'm not really a wine guy, more of a beer beer drinker. Um, how is how is beer made? Is it similar? Tell me about your strange partner. Oh. Why the number? Oh, this is the kind of juicy eavesdropping. I, I want to be doing it in this party. I say eavesdropping, I'm standing right here. They can see me. I mean, Diana knows I'm here. She knows what I look like. She's just just trying to blank me. Meanwhile, Tamara has, has no idea, apparently, what I look like. Look at him. for empathy was removed along with his memories. What was your relationship? Yeah, tell, tell him. Tell her, Diana. He's broken in many ways. But he is self-aware about it, and he tries his best to be whole. Over the years, we found an arrangement. You could say he outsourced his contract. Interesting, very revealing, Diana. Contracts, navigate the murky moral waters that he was unable to fathom. He was the gun. I was the safety. Fascinating. What an extraordinary display of trust. It's no more than what any soldier does. Of course. Who came up with the accident MO? It began with a jet ejection seat. But that's a story for another time. Oh, Diana. I'd do anything for you, Diana. And his hands? Well, I figure the world could do a lot worse. It's weird hearing Diana's voice not in my ear, but just like in the world. It's a bit strange. Oh, she's going over to the edge. She's got to go over. She's got to go over. Uh, but I've got to deal with these two security guards first. All right, okay. Uh, ah, okay, I can get him in that bush. So if I lob the, the old sports coin in there, yep, that'll do. And then he'll come round. Yeah, and maybe I can deal with him. And then if I can just get the other guard to look away, even for a moment, maybe I can just bundle her over the edge. It'd be brilliant. Okay, let's get this guy subdued. Yeah. Okay, go to sleep, please. Oh, look at this. What's this? Some kind of wine, wine press? Could a human being stand in that, do you think? I don't think it could. Someone would have to prove it to me. Do any of you have questions? I have yes, I have a question. It's perhaps we can take a closer look. Yes. Lead the way. Let's all go stand in the wine press. I'll take a picture of the view of you. Oh, come on, Tamara. When in Rome. Fine. 
All right, so we're going to get... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Diana, do do Diana. Diana, you can't go in there. Let's see. Again, you Diana is James heavily blanking me. She knows I'm here. Like She's got situational James. awareness. But I still liked him. <laughs> right. Okay, they're going this way now. Um, you know what? Let's uh, let's go see if I can find another. Hello. Look at this. Look, 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 look. Okay, so there's another hose pipe. Oh, and another uh, lamp. Another garden lamp. So if I just just uh, if hopefully no one's looking, I can just jam a screwdriver in the works here. Get a sabotage going. Okay, this could work, or I could electrocute like half a dozen people in a go. Okay, other guy needs to be looking away. So let's pop a coin behind here. Maybe he'll come around and look. Oh, she's looking. Why is she looking? Okay, he's looking the other way, but no, she's moving. Being the odd one out. What's that supposed to mean? You're an outlier too, tomorrow. Oh no, she's going. She's going. She's going. She's going over. She's going over. Oh, he looked. Fine, whatever. Well, I can vault in here and I can get the new outfit, can't I? That'll be fine. All right, we're going to get a picture inside the Grape Crusher. They guess so. May I see that, Mr. Vargas? I believe I blinked. Yes, Diana, yes. Get out of the Grape Press. Gr brilliant idea. All right, here we go. Oh, oh, it looks like Tamara had... Oh, my God. Looks like one for the mantle. I was going to say it looked like she had a pressing engagement, but then... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And there's a notice coming this way, which is... Bad times. All right, okay, that was a bit of a missed opportunity because they have walked right past... Right past the kill zone. Why does this guy know, know who I am? Who is he? Why is he so alert? All right, now or never, 47. All right, notice has got their back turned. Diana's walked past the kill box. Uh, let's, get the, let's get this hose pipe on. And, and, yes, yes. That is a shocking accident, wouldn't you say, Diana? Diana, where are you? Are you did you see? Did you see, Diana? That was me. I know it looked like an accident, but it was me. Are you proud? Are you pleased? Is this what you wanted? Does it please you? Diana, please give me attention. I'm, oh, she's leaving. Oh, no. Okay, I just need to get out. Yeah? Have I done it? I've done it! They have no idea. Look, they can't see a thing. I've, oh, they're notices now. But that's fine. I've got a new outfit. I'm in the clear, you guys. That worked. That is the dumbest thing I've ever done in Hitman, and it was fine. It was absolutely fine, which means, ladies and gents, I haven't learnt my lesson at all. Oh, I'm being noticed. Let's let's just let's just chill. Let's just cool it, guys. Oh boy, notices for days. Uh, you know what? Let's just let's just let everyone chill out, okay? Everyone chill. I know someone's died here, but this is fine. Wait, I need another bottle of wine. Uh, what to choose? Cabernet Sauvignon. Right, you'll, yep. And you. All right. Oh, God. You as well. Do you want one? Don't worry. I'm not going to kill you. I'm just going to take your clothes and stuff you in a wardrobe. <laughs> oh, Diana is going to absolutely love this. In comes the sommelier. Who is it? 47. That's right. Diana, it's me. Agent 47, from work. 